I've been wrestling a long time, and I've always wrestled not to impress people, but to win, you know, to be the best. When I was 10 years old, or now 27 years old. Match of the year, maybe for some, <clears throat> not for Davy Richards, not for the American Wolf, not then, not now. It'll be match of the year when I win the belt. And Tyler does, he has a lot of heart, you know. Tyler fought that night, you know, I hit him with everything I had, you know, and he kept coming back, and I knew he was going to do that. You know, and Tyler said something in an interview shortly after about being the best in the world that I think really showed me a lot of maturity. He said, you know, Ring of Honor is the best in the world. And that, that hit a special place to me because he's right. You know, I'm not friends with Tyler. I never have been friends with Tyler, but he's right. You know, Ring of Honor is we're the best in the world. Are. We're the best in the world. And that night, Tyler was better than Davey Richards. But Roger's the same person he's always been. You know, Roger's an athlete. You know, I feel sorry for him that he's got involved with this idiot, you know, but I know Roderick. I knew him from my NRC days, you know, and he's a fighter, you know. We went 20 minutes to Chicago, and I still stand after a battle like that, which before he would keep coming and keep coming, he would crave it, he would live for it, he would learn from it. He was a wrestler, he was a fighter. And I called five more minutes, fully expecting to get it, because, we, you know, that's, that's how we came up. And he didn't accept it. And I just, I don't understand it. I don't know if that shows weakness, or just a complete change of uh, complete change of faith, you know? Maybe his faith's not in just actual wrestling ability anymore. Maybe it's in this new manager that he's got. But we'll find out. You know, he put a title shot on the line. That tells me something, so I'm gonna find out firsthand.